We begin tonight with a new push to address homelessness in San Diego County. Now, the County Board of Supervisors is expected to take up a proposal tomorrow that would allocate tens of millions of dollars toward the issue. And Fox 5's Jamie Chambers starts us off live along the Embarcadero with what we're learning about it. Jamie. Hey guys, yeah, this is the major issue that everyone seems to be facing for quite some time now. Politicians have been trying to tackle this for decades, but now one of the Board of Supervisors member is pushing $66 million, trying to earmark that amount of money to try to tackle this issue really once and for all. In the fight against systemic homelessness in San Diego County, Supervisor Tara Lawson Reamer is trying to rally the Board of Supervisors to make a generational investment into getting people off the streets. We're looking at training behavioral health workers because we know we're on track to be about 18,000 workers short uh, countywide. Um, and we're also looking at building out more beds so people who are in the hospital but um, they don't need to be there anymore. They have a kind of an intersection of uh, medical issues, behavioral health issues. They need ongoing care and recuperative care, uh, but they don't need to be in the hospital. Uh, they have a place to go because right now they often just end up out in the streets. The supervisor says it's time the county leverage their $66 million left over from COVID to invest in programs that unlock even more federal dollars to attack the intransigent problems of homelessness, which has been building over the last two decades. The idea is to invest some money up front um, that we have here at the county that we've been able to kind of save and hold back from our COVID expenditures and then use that to get back significantly more, two, three, four, five times more back uh, from the federal government to help uh, pay for some of these big investments. The city of San Diego is also pushing for more facilities for transitional homelessness. The county is also working to build out more beds for rehabilitation center and treatment. But Supervisor Lawson Reamer says the biggest investment would be made into those 18,000 health and human service workers focused on substance abuse and transitional care who could act as a small army to combat the homelessness problem. You can build all the facilities in the world, but if you don't have anywhere, anyone to work there, uh, it's not going to help. And the big question moving forward is at the County Board of Supervisors meeting tomorrow, can they get everyone pushing in the same direction? Will they allocate those $66 million towards this program for those 18,000 health care and uh, abuse training workers? Or will they break that money up into different programs? We'll all wait and see. But that would be a huge investment for the future in this process. That's the very latest from the Waterfront Park at the County Board of Supervisors. Jamie Chambers, Fox 5 News. Jimmy, thank you.